Okay. Oh, whoops. Oh, Tom, how's it going, Mr. Cruise Control? I know it's it's been years. I, I look, I've not been trying to ignore you, but ever since the whole, you know, standing on the chair, it's I know ten, ten years. It's uh, you know I, I don't like holding a grudge, but I think this is healthy to get our friendship, our really long two-year friendship, you know, back back on track. So no, it has nothing to do with you know Maverick coming out in in a month and and you know me just trying to hang on your coattails. Obviously not. No, I'm I'm here to talk about you know the future. The, the future, you know, space, space, baby. <laughs> I know you're doing that whole teaming up with Elon Musk and SpaceX to film the first movie in space. I, I think this is just a, a prime opportunity for me to rekindle this friendship, you know, that obviously, you know, we're like brothers, man. We've got the same hair, got the same s shades. But hey, heard heard you'll be coming to Atlanta next week to start, uh, you know, doing some some meetings for this movie. So hey, I figured we should stop and uh, get a, a bite, a bitey bite. Uh, not sure why you're laughing so much into my ear. Like, not, not, sure, not sure why. Look, there's no reason to be rude here, okay? We have been far and away from each other for a long time. Okay, fine, fine. I'll just tweet Elon Musk myself, and I'll go that route. So, see you later, Maverick. Wow, what a short fuse. Hi, my name is Gabriel Manic. I'm an actor, and I'm starving! Not a bad spot. Not a bad spot. Jet's Pizza. I'm not gonna pretend like we didn't talk about this before. Have you had Jet's Pizza before? Once or twice. Once or twice. I don't remember you telling me that. No, no, you tell me. Once or twice. That's that's true. That's true. Jet's Pizza. Mighty Duck John has been mentioning this place to me for a while now, and. You know, it's uh, it's Detroit style. I don't think I, I'm sure I've had Detroit style pizza at some point in my life. I just don't remember. But I remember walking into one of these places closer to me, and it just looks great. So you know, finally, it's in the air. It smells fantastic. I want to take a look. Wow, this looks good. This looks so good. Obviously, got Jared's slice in here, which is the pepperoni, and then one up top is the the cheese. Man, that. It's like well done, crispy. It feels hot from the bottom. I hope this is not one of those uh, one bite pizza review where it's like burn you the roof. Yeah, it's hot. It's hot. Um, well, they've been around since 1978. Not this location, <laughs> but the company in general. And uh, Detroit. Let's see. What can I? What else can I say? Holy moly. I guess I gotta get used to this. I've actually been to Detroit once. I was actually coincidentally, coincidentally, the music that you hear in the intro and at, and at the end of the, the video, that's a song called Stay With Me, which is a song I wrote for this girl who lives in Michigan. And who, this is like back when I was like 15, 16, 18. And I wrote a song <laughs> about how I was on a Greyhound bus going to visit her. And I stopped in Detroit. Uh, that's where the bus depot was. And I got to see these guys like freestyle, like eight mile style. And it was really, really cool. It was really cold. And <coughs> the pollen, you know, I, no. You want me to have Parmesan cheese on, on the pizza? You want me to have garlic powder on the, or oregano? No, no, I want pollen. I want Georgia pollen on this pizza. That is the way to go. <coughs> This is insane. Maybe it's a sign that I'm talking too much. First bites. <coughs> COVID cough. <coughs> I'll COVID my cough. <coughs> <coughs> Hold on. <coughs> Jared, did I cough all over your slice? I don't know. All right. First bite's the one that counts when you're starving. beautiful sound of me not talking. Oh, so beautiful. Mm. It's not bad. <laughs> Is that hot? 
Yeah, I just got straight sauce onto my palate. That burned. That burned. I should be blowing on this. Now I feel like I'm drunk. And I've had no alcohol. Oh my god. There we go, we got the crunch factor. It seems like there's more on the sweet side. Not too much salt, which I, I kind of want a little more from. I kind of want a little more, more salt on this, but it's really good. Mm, well done. My face, my face is just, it's making all the expressions today. I'm testing out new muscles in my face I've never used before. All right, let's go on the back end. Mmm. The back end was the best bite so far. That's that's pretty good. It's pretty pretty good. Like I mentioned, it's it's more on the sweet side, which I wouldn't. I'm not 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 too crazy about, but still very very good. Love the cheese factor. Love the fact that it's well done. Love the crispiness. So today, Jet's Pizza on a Detroit style, which is my first one I'm reviewing. I'm gonna go with um, I'll go seven four seven four for Detroit style. If it wasn't for my mouth burning, maybe it would have been different. But 7-4 is good. So definitely check out your local because they're nationwide. Um, I'll see you on the next review. I'm not going to leave you with a joke.